let's get started on a new day. It's Thursday. This is day, what, four of the island? You know, I really should be keeping count, huh? So I think this is day four of the island. Um, Blathers isn't here. What's this? Oh, gee. Thanks, Nook Mileage Program. Strange. Oh, I <laughs> I ordered this, didn't I? Oh, that's, that's nice. Um, that's nice. Oh, great. <laughs> it is very clear that in my time on this island, though it only be three days, I have made very quick work of ruining the beach. But don't worry about that. We have time to make it better, I guess. Make it worse? Who's to say? Okay, let's focus. Let's focus on what we need to do today. I feel like we need to be making some plans. Um, because I'll be the first to admit that I haven't been making as much progress towards escaping the island as I thought I would. And in fact, I'm getting a little distracted by these delightful things, like this carp kite. Uh, which I'm assuming is kind of the point. I do think that the coons are probably trying to distract me. And this whole museum is another example. I mean, how much time did I spend yesterday getting 15 specimen for Blathers when I don't even know what this Blathers fellow's up to? We don't actually know what kind of museum he's doing. We don't really know what kind of research he's investigating. But I mean, if he's saying that he's gonna, you know, need bugs and fish and stuff, fossils, well, in order to keep people from getting suspicious of my activities, I probably ought to help. Because I think that's probably my primary strategy at the moment is just keep everybody from suspecting what I'm actually up to. What the heck? I'm sorry, am I only just noticing that cat has an actual house? When did they do that? Cat, what the heck? <laughs> How come you have a proper house? Wait a minute, does Beth have a proper house now? Gee whiz, why does... Okay, let's see what this message says. Wolfgang, okay. What is up with people using messages in bottles not to ask for help, but to send DIY recipes? This has got to be some sort of code that I just have yet to crack. Um, okay, <laughs> let's chat with Biff. What the heck? How come you have a house? I don't know why you're insisting on putting down permanent roots. Um, Biff? Uh... Let's talk. We need to talk. Um. Jeez. I'm 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 certainly glad that's not the case. But if you were, I could, I'm confused. If you were wanting, and if you were expecting more of a survivalist experience, why did you get a house? very strange. It is very clear to me that I don't have as much of a grasp on the goings-on of this island as I previously thought. I got cocky. I'll be the first to admit it. Am I resentful of the fact that I missed so much? Perhaps. Oh shoot, I did forget to water my flowers. So I guess here's the thing. Um, if Cap and Biff both have proper houses, they ditched their tents for houses, is it suspicious that I'm not trying to do the same? What do you think? I think it might be smidged at suspicious. Where should I plant this tree? Uh, yeah, let's plant a pear right here. Don't ask questions, I just happen to know that this is how to do it. Instinct. Once you're on an island long enough, you get a sense for these sorts of things. 
peaches and pears, peaches and pears. I cannot think of a better combination than peaches and pears. What I should have said is I can't imagine a better pairing than peaches and pears. Whatever. I don't, I'm not here because I make jokes. But I think my primary concern at the moment is how come the other two cap T's have houses? I ought to remedy this, I think. Hi, friends. Don't mind me. Thank you. Mr. Nook, tomboy. Hello, hello. Um, let's talk about this whole home situation. Yeah. So long as you don't put, like, secret passageways in this house. <laughs> Jeez. Um. Jeez, that's a lot of money to be once again indebted to this coon, which is obviously what he's up to. But at the same time, I can't make him suspicious because then he'll start to realize that I'm trying to leave. Ah, let's do it. I've, you know what? I think I can make 98K, right? Let's just do it. Let's just do it. We can't have him suspecting that I'm trying to get off. Because the debt won't even mean anything, right? If I can get off, it doesn't matter if I haven't paid my full debt, because I'm gone. Oh, a roof color? We probably ought to choose something uh, very noticeable. Should we do red? Pink, maybe? Bleh. I feel like red on a beach is going to be pretty darn noticeable. Thanks. Okay. Yeah, it's funny how he locks certain opportunities until I do something he wants me to do. Yeah, yes, it's very exciting, Mr. Nook. Very exciting. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oops, I sh forgot to put that. Bye. All right, I need to give Biff his little chair. Um, right here, how about? Now I probably ought to go... Oh, I should probably... Do I have my watering can? Yeah, I should probably water these flowers. Not much of a garden, but you know what? I'm not much of a gardener, and evidently neither is Cat, neither is Beth. Whoa, out of my way, friend. Here, have some breakfast. Bra oh, brass! Worse, worser and worser. Could I get a non flimsy fishing rod? Is that possible? Sorry, I don't mean to be such a brat, but you keep giving me things that break, and I don't have a lot of tools. You dig? Oh, the money! The money! The money rock! Should I get that pill bug? Can I try? Is he still moving? No, stop moving, pill bug. It takes me too long to get my thing. Come back. Come back to me. Yeah, oh, pills. I get it. That's a joke. Ha uh ha. -huh. Oh, yes. Oh, I'm so rich now. Who knew that there was a place way across the sea where money came from trees? and rocks and from the sky. <sighs> Very strange. Oh, fishies. Hey. I didn't realize one could be so bad at fishing. Come here. Okay, let's get this butterfly. You better fly away. Ha ha ha. Don't really, because I need to catch you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How you're gonna find a rare blue bottle on this island is anybody's guess. Okay, let's see what else we can find on this side of the island. Wait. Dang it, I'm full. 
Let's actually not see what else we can find on this side of the island. What's that sound? Am I gonna ruin my shovel just trying to locate this mysterious sound? <gasps> oh, a nefarious buggy. Gotta get it. Oh, you, you creepy thing. Oh my gosh, I can't imagine there is things like you on this island. Help me, help me. Things coming out of the ground. Very uh, rude of you. Let's go drop that off. I'm sure the uh, blathers will like it. Well, he won't like it actually. He doesn't seem to like buggies. Uh, please just stay right here. Oh, what the heck? You're never safe. Oh, come on. This day is a day of absolutely breaking every single tool I own. A present. Aha! Lucky me. What could it be? A pants press? Let's sell this. What the heck would you need a pants press for? We're on an island. Gee whiz, I'm good at getting stuff today. Oh, I can take a... <laughs> I can take a picture. A little blurry, isn't it? That's okay. That will commemorate Blathers moving in. Which I mean is a little creepy. Another person who we don't really know much about coming to the island, but I don't know. I'm just here. I just work here. I'm not trying to do anything sneaky. Of course not I. Not me. Oh yeah, put your smiles in place, boys. I'm back. And I want to sit. Well, let me tell you. I've got some mysterious items, but don't think too deeply about how I came by them. If you don't know about the presents flying by, I'm not going to be the one to tell you. My pleasure. My absolute pleasure. <laughs> yeah, let's see what we can do. Pretty good tools. Tool ring. That sounds good. Okay, let's see what this let's see what this tool ring is. Evidently it's essential, so let's let's get it. <laughs> I'm glad it makes sense to you. What else? There's a whole world of wonderful things here. I don't care. I'm on an island. Why do I care about hairstyles? Pretty good tool recipe. Let's check it out. I wish I could actually see what it was all about. You dig? Oh, I dig. Perhaps I'll dig better with this pretty good shovel. That's included. Yay! Okay, good. <gasps> Phenomenal. Phenomenal. Heck, let's... Goodbye, fiends. Let's go check out this great new deal. We're about to change our whole perspective on this island living. I don't know if they knew they were giving me an opportunity to build stronger, better weapons, but boy, is that what I'm gonna do right now? I'm here, tool bench. They'll never know what I'm up to now. You know, they don't seem too worried about what I'm all up to. I don't think whatever Timmy Tommy is running around the island, I don't think they're really aware of what I'm up to. Just good for me. That we've got significantly superior tools. Let's go wreck some havoc. I mean, gather more materials to sell. Let's get more uh, peaches. Not all of them. We can't go wasting resources just because I'm trying to pay. It. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. So, if Cat and Biff both have houses, doesn't that suggest that they've managed to pay off their debts? Their their 
um, 5,000 miles. Is that likely? They don't seem like the resourceful types. Are they just in more debt? That makes me a little nervous, if I'm being perfectly frank. I don't like the idea of... Certainly not this. I don't like... The, oh, what the heck? A fortune telling set? What on earth? Who put that there? Could have been Biff. This is right by Biff's house. Here, we'll just give it back to Biff. Here, Biff. I found your fortune telling set. Jeez, is he hiding money? What? Could it be that Biff is just putting things in trees? I guess I wouldn't be super surprised, but I'm surprised nonetheless. Cat, why are you still asleep? What the heck? It's not possible that Cat could be over here somewhere, right? That seems unlikely. Ooh, whoa. What the heck? Who are you? Do you think that this fellow escaped from a nearby island? What? Who are you? Whoa. Whoa. What? Hi, Gulliver. Well, yes, look up on the beach. Oh, certainly. Oh, so you're just a... You're gonna get rescued? There's gonna be a ship coming? Uh-oh. No. No. That could take forever. I've been waiting for, what, three few days? Oh, we can fix it? Yes! Um, okay. I didn't realize that I would be able to be rescued after so few days. <gasps> Phenomenal. Gosh, we could get off the island today. Oh man, I guess that means I have to really think about who I want to take with me. I mean, obviously Biff. Maybe Cat. I don't know. Cat might be one of the conspirators. I haven't quite ruled that out. I don't want to bring Cat aboard just to have them then completely sabotage the ship and have everybody crash, including the crew. Can you imagine? This is my big shot of getting off this island once and for all. Just need to get, what, three more communicator parts. Haha! -ha! Excellent. I'm so glad I decided to do rounds on the island. I kind of thought I was just running around doing a patrol kind of aimlessly, but <laughs> it was my lucky day. For this, yes, that's all five. Wonderful, okay. Gulliver, my friend, my savior. I'm sending it here, there's no point. I will be here. 
Oh, is it gonna be a few hours? Would you mind letting me know when they get here, Gulliver? I certainly don't wanna miss out on this wonderful opportunity of um, getting off this dreaded island. I better go try to tell Biff that we're about to get off this confounded island. Okay, gotta tell Biff about Gulliver. Hey, Biff, Biffru, Biff, my bro. Um, I have to tell you about this skull guy. Oh my gosh, Biff. Stop it. Okay, Biff, we are best friends, which is why I am here to tell you. Oh. Well, I don't know if you know this, but you don't have to stay on this island. We actually, we actually can get off. I don't really know how to explain it, but this, this bird, the seagull called Gulliver came to our island and wait, come back. I'm telling you something important. His crew is going to come to pick him up. So we're going to be able to get off this island. What do you say, pal? What do you say, bro? Oh my gosh. Is Biff giving me the silent treat? Does Biff not want to go? Is it just going to be me? Oh my gosh, Biff hates me. He hates me. He hates the idea. I honestly wasn't anticipating that. I guess I have no choice but to see if Cat will go. Biff weirdly rebuffed me. I was... I was not expecting that. How on earth did it not see that? Let's ignore. Everybody is giving me the cold shoulder. The big freeze. The silent treatment. All because... I want to escape. Is that such a crime? Oh, cat's awake. Wow. Hey, cat. I agree. You think that's weird, too? What kind of action are you talking about? Certainly not hunting people for sport, right, Cat? Oh my gosh, Cat, is that why you're here? I think I'm finally putting the pieces together. Cat totally looks like the type that would hunt other people for, for sport. Oh my gosh. Look at the way they're looking at me. Okay, bye, Cat. I, you know what? I'm not... I'm not going to take a ri the risk of uh, mentioning that I'm about to get rescued. You would totally, you would do your utmost to make sure I didn't get off alive. So bye cat, <laughs> don't mind me, I may never see you again. I can't believe the time has come where I'm finally going to escape this island. I'm really excited that I had this experience. There's a lot of great memories, I suppose. I got to meet Biff in any case, but you know, I, w I won't be, I won't be crying not coming back to this island. I, I think I paid my dues. I think I worked hard and you know what? It's time to go home. So, hey, thanks everybody for sticking around for this long. I really appreciate it. Sorry, not sorry, I won't be seeing you again because I'm certainly getting off this island. Gulliver and I are escaping and I won't have to sleep one more day on this island. So I better gather up my stuff and get over there and make sure I don't miss that ship. Yeah, thanks for joining me on this journey. I guess this is goodbye forever. Hasta la vista, baby. We're off the island and we're sailing home free.